Ulysses Gaze is a 1995 Greek film directed by Theo Angelopoulos and starring Harvey Keitel, Maya Morgenstern, and Erland Josephson. The film was selected as the Greek entry for the Best Foreign Language Film at the 68th Academy Awards but it was not nominated. Plot Successful Greek filmmaker, A. Harvey Keitel returns to Greece. He has come to participate in a screening of one of his earlier films and to begin a personal journey across the Balkans. After the screening is disrupted by local ideological conflict, A takes a taxi from Greece to Albania. Ostensibly A is searching for three undeveloped reels of film shot by the Menarchy brothers. The mysterious reels could predate the brothers' first film, The Weavers which is believed to be the first film shot in the Balkans. A's journey fuses his own memories, the experiences of the Manarchy brothers, and contemporary images of the Balkans. A drifts from Albania to North Macedonia, Bulgaria, Romania and Serbia. He travels on a train, a barge laden with a statue of Lenin, Polyphemus, and eventually a rowboat. Though A makes some acquaintances along the way, he never lingers. His search for the roots of cinema, memory, and the Balkan identity pull him inevitably towards decay and death. Who eventually travels to the besieged Sarajevo. He meets Ivo Levy, Erland Josephson, the curator of an underground cinema archive who had attempted to develop the missing reels before the war. A convinces Levy to continue his work with the reels. The film ends on a rare foggy day in Sarajevo. Ironically the fog protects locals from snipers and gives the city a rare chance to flourish. Who explores the city with Levy's family. Near the river the family encounters military personnel and are executed. 